Want to decrease diabetes rates in Canada? Instead of building a hospital, the answer might be to build nothing at all. I'm Dan Riskin. If you've got a plot of land, you can leave it as it is, as a forest, and make no money from it, or you can build houses there, or condos, or a warehouse, and then charge rent. From an economic perspective, that's always been a no-brainer. And that's especially true in cities where real estate is at a premium. But of course, natural places have benefits too, and a new paper is out exploring one of them. People like parks, and one thing they tend to do in parks is exercise. And in cities, where green spaces are hard to come by, a little green space can have an oversized impact on public health. Regular exercise reduces the incidence of more than 20 health conditions, including diabetes, hypertension, cardiovascular diseases, and even cancer. And by reducing those diseases, they also reduce the costs associated with those diseases. In a city with millions of citizens, green spaces save lives and they save dollars. Right now, that math doesn't factor into land use decisions, and that's what the scientists who wrote this paper are arguing. A good economic reason to think twice before we pave paradise to put up a parking lot. For ctvnews.ca, I'm Dan Riskin.